Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will learn about the another join operator, uh, category operator that is concatall. Now, what is this concatall? So, we already know about this concat operator. We have already learned about this concat operator. So, the same, in the same scenario, it will be the concat operator. Whereas, this concatall, what it will try to do is, it will try to apply concatall, concat these all the inner observables, okay? converts a higher order observable into a first order observable by concatenating the inner, obse inner observable in order. So, previously we have seen about this combined latest all. Combined latest all, it will subscribe to all the inner observables and whatever the, if any of the uh, observable emits the data, it will take the latest value from, uh, from each of the inner observable and it will send you as an array. Whereas this concat all, what it will try to do is, in the same scenario, it will take all the inner observables and it will subscribe to the inner observable. First, it will emit all the uh, all the values that is emitted by the first inner observable. Then it will switch to the second one. Then it will switch, switch to the third one. Then the uh, like this, it will it will execute the inner observables in order. So that is the concat all. For example, here if you try to see here concat all, there is no parameters for this one. So the, just you can apply it to the operator directly. Sorry, observable directly using pipe operator. Now if you try to see this. Uh, what I can say, marble, uh, marble diagram. Here we are having a source observable. Source observable, each time it is emitting an observable, okay, inner observable. Each time it is observing an inner observable. Now, inner observable, what it is trying to do here, in first inner observable is emitting the AB, second one CD, EF, right? So, when you pass this uh, source observable to the concat all operator, then what it will happen is, first it will take this inner observable, first, obs first inner observable will be subscribed, and it will emit all the data AB what, until it is completed. So after it completed inner observable, then it will go to the second observable. Again, CD will be executed when it is completed, then it will go to the third observable. Like this, it will go on execute the inner observables until all the inner observables is completed. So this is the concat all. Whereas the concat operator, what it will try to do? So you will supply it to the, uh, you will supply the list of observables to the concat operator, first order observables. So first observables, outer observables, you will be having list of observables. So, one by one, one by one, it will execute. Whereas, here it will execute the inner observables. Okay, observable of observables. So, this is about the concat all. If you try to see here, joins every observable emitted by a source a higher order in a serial fashion. It subscribes to each inner observable only after the previous inner observable has completed and merges all their values to the return observable. Warning, if the source observable emits observable quickly and endlessly and the inner observable emits gener generally complete slower than the source image, you can run into your memory issues. This is the common thing. So, if the source observable is emitting the, that means if the main order observable is emitting the values immediately, quickly, quickly means, so then you will run into your memory issues. Concat all is equivalent to merge with the concurrency parameter set to 1. So, we will see about that one. So, the same scenario, the concat how is, will be the equivalent to the merge with the concurrency parameter set to 1. Now, let us try to see the practical implementation of this concat all. Now, here let us try to create, I will close these all the things. Okay, now I am creating here nggc pages slash concat all operator. Now, here let us try to add this concat all operator, and here I am adding concat all, and here also I will add concat all. And here in this app routing, what I will try to do is I will try to add here also sorry concat all and here also I will add concat all oh concat all operator component yeah now let us go to the implementation of this one concat all it is a simple thing only so oh, concat all right yeah now in this one let us assume that we have a source same thing source dollar is equal to of of and we are having something values like a comma b okay we are having two values and each value will limit a inner observable now what i can do source dollar dot pipe okay i can use the map operator and here you will get the value and this one will return interval of okay thousand let's assume now here let's add this map operator Okay, now here I can do the subscribe and I can do the data, sorry, 
and I can do the console.log of data. And that's it. Now let's try to see the output. So how how come this one looks? Let's try to see. Mm, yeah, concat all. If I click on this, sorry, if I click on this concat all, yeah, we are getting two observables, right? So that means nothing but two intervals. Now I want to execute the first interval. And afterwards, I need to execute the second interval. Now let's try to take this one as pipe of okay, take of four or something like that. Okay. Or otherwise, what I will try to do is here I will try to create um, two comma four. Okay, we are having two comma four. And here what I will do is so that value I will take into this one. So take of value. I will write take of value. So that means first interval will limit to only two values, 0, 1. And the second interval will limit 0, 1, 2, 3. Now let's try to see the output. If I try to see the output, um, no, no, okay, okay. First, what we'll try to do is so we'll try to apply it to the we'll try to apply it, apply it concat all operator. That's it. Now we have applied this one concat all, right? So where this one is applying pipe of take and here it is applied and to here okay we need to apply it outside okay and we here we need to apply it yeah here we need to apply it. that's it so concat all now if i try to open this one so how come this one will look so let's it refresh now if it refreshes let's try to see so 0 1 is emitted and again 0 1 2 3 so how come this one is executing is first First interval is subscribed. So concat all will take the first interval. It will take the values two only. So that means interval has to execute only uh, has to emit only two values. That is the reason it has emitted 0, 1 and it completed. Now next it will take the second interval. So it will emit 0, 1, 2, 3. Now if you take something like if you have something like 10, now what could be the output? The same thing. So last interval it will execute with the 10 times. So 10, 0 to 9 it will execute. Now, for example, if I try to keep here, let us try to keep it little bit faster. Okay. Now, if you try to see the output. <coughs> so, now how come this one output will look like? See, 0, 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. Again, 0, 1, 2, up to 9, it will execute. Okay. 7, 8, 9. So, this is how the concat all will execute. So, the concat all will take the first inner observable, it will execute completely, and afterwards, it will take the second one. So, like this, go on in a serial fashion. In order, in order wise, it will execute. For example, if you are having like this something around, so like this means, so first it will execute the 0, 1, 2, 9, it will be print, printed first. Then only afterwards only it will take the 0, 1, 0, 1 and 0, 1, 2, 3 like this. See, first it is taking, first it is completing the interval observable which is having 10 values. Then after it is taking like, like that it will execute. Okay, hope you understood about this concat all also. In the previous combined latest all, what it will try to do? It will try to take the latest value from each inter, from each inner observable. Here, one observable after the observable, it will execute. So, this is about the concat all. Hope you understood about this concat all. If you have any doubts or any suggestions, please post the comments below to this video. And if you like this video, please do support me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you.